what up today we are getting right into it so i've driven past this spot a couple times but uh, i've never actually gotten to skate it just because there's always been cars here and it's always been like open i guess i don't really know what it is uh but it's like absolutely perfect so today i'm gonna be able to have some fun on it i'm doing it for myself and for you guys because it's super fun for me just to just to skate in general so i can't wait to show you guys check it out right here so this is the actual spot you go off that chimney and then off this roof climbing up it is kind of difficult because it's broken because it's been climbed up for so long i think but it has a lot of potential i mean look at this it's literally perfect go right off the top and then down into here the only thing you have to worry about is if you're like me and don't have a spotter uh you're gonna have to make sure you don't get hit by a car <laughs> but i hope i don't get kicked out today uh because i've heard that usually you get kicked out i have never skated it because there's always been cars here today i'm gonna try to skate it i want to get something on it because it looks so fun <laughs> So I'm stoked. So the main problem with skating on roofs is one, you can get in a lot of trouble, but two, you can actually hear it very loud inside if you are in the building. So you have to be pretty quick and do your tricks, hoping that no one is actually inside of the building because they will hear it uh, no matter what room they're in most likely. So you kind of got to be quick and to the point. So getting on top of this roof absolutely sucked. I mean, it being broken made it so difficult. And uh, this attempt, I'm just gonna go for a regular tail drop, but I gotta make sure there's no cars coming first. <laughs> Luckily that was first try, uh, but now I have to get back up there to try the tail drop kickflip. And I'm actually sitting here looking around because this lady was walking her dog and uh, she kind of seemed like if I was up there, she probably wouldn't have been stoked, so. <laughs> My first attempt at the tail drop kickflip, I almost like leaned too far forward and fell off the roof, but I wanted to do it so bad that I didn't let it scare me too much. The first couple tries weren't looking too promising, if I'm being honest. Then I was having to like walk down uh, the roof to actually see the cars coming from the other side because I could not see them from the top of that. And so that's why I'm kind of like in this corner over here looking around. As soon as I saw that there were no cars coming in that direction, I had to like quickly run back up the roof and then I got a uh, attempt in. And I got really lucky because right here is when I start actually sticking and landing uh, on my board. So then after that, it was kind of like in my head to just commit. Another thing is I didn't want to be standing up at the top too long for people to call, so I had to keep kind of jumping down behind the fireplace <laughs> in order for them not to call. This sucked because my board fell off the roof, which meant I had to jump off the roof and then climb up that stupid fence again, so that was not very fun. <laughs> at this point, uh, I finally got a good attempt. And again, too far forward. <laughs> so close. So then I tried to lean back. That did not help. And another leaning too far back. <laughs> I leaned too far back three times. It had been about 30 minutes since I started trying this and I really did not want to slip out again. Uh, I had already fallen couple times trying to roll off the roof so I was just like I gotta fully commit and just like even up my body and uh, I got pretty lucky I think <laughs> so it worked out <laughs> I finally got it I'm super stoked it's so crazy because it made me feel like being back home in Evansville, Indiana, because 
I used to skate on top of roofs a lot and have to like watch out for police and this and that and dealing with people trying to kick me out of the place and then calling the police by driving by and it just made me feel like that for some reason I had like a crazy nostalgia wave hit me and so it was like fun but also it was actually really difficult I kept doing the kickflip and then rolling off the roof and not being able to land it and I think it's because in my mind I had so much anxiety about all the cars because I can see this corner turning that I'll show you guys uh, and I but I can't see that side and I'm about to go up on top of the roof to show you what I can and couldn't see. It was really weird because every time I would feel like I'm good, someone on this side would just turn in really fast because I could see them turning, but I couldn't see them right before the turn. So I couldn't see a buildup on either sides. So my anxiety was going off the roof that I would land and then just get absolutely smoked by a car. So that was very scary. <laughs> and I'm gonna show you guys that right now because I'm gonna climb up on the roof one more time. Getting up on the fence is so difficult too because it's broken. And oh, here's the police officer. They're pointing, they're looking for me. I gotta get the fuck out of here. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I I'll, saw the skateboard, so. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll get out of here. Are you for your friend to, to... No, no, he's gone. He, he left. I can't skate off that. That's way too gnarly so for is me. Is there anyone else there right now? Right now, no one's there. He, he landed it and left because he didn't want to get in trouble. I get it. Um, all good. They just called us about, you know, skating on the roof. Obviously, we don't want that. So yeah. If you guys could just not do that for the rest of the day. I'd oh, yeah, of course, okay? of course, yeah. You got any comments, questions? Anything? No, no, yeah, I completely understand. Okay, have a good day, sir. You too, thank yeah. you. Slides so hard, I feel bad, but like, I didn't want to get in trouble. <laughs> I was gonna show you guys the top of the roof, but never mind. Fuck that. I'm not getting back up there. I'm not supposed to be on a roof, but like, come on. It's not that big of a deal. I'm okay. Everyone's fine. I probably shouldn't have lied, but like, I, it wasn't causing any harm for me to lie. I didn't feel, I didn't feel like I was like causing more problems lying. So, I just was like, all right, uh, my friend did it and he left because I don't want to, I don't want to get in trouble if I don't have to. And now I'm going to leave because they're still there. There they are. I got very lucky that the police did not give me a ticket. Um, if you're ever encountering the police, try to just be polite. I know it sucks, but if you're polite, most of the time they'll let you off with just a warning. Uh, I probably shouldn't have lied, but I don't. I'm gonna be honest with you, it didn't matter either way. I don't think I was gonna get a ticket either way. Uh, but that's pretty much it. I mean, that was a really fun little time. I got to get the trick I really wanted. I got it literally right before the cops came, so I'm super stoked about that. I, I literally landed it, walked over across the street, started filming, and it maybe was three minutes in between all that. And uh, then there they were, right after that little monologue I was doing. I was gonna show you guys the top of the roof and I obviously I couldn't in the end. Uh, and yeah, that was pretty much, that was my day. So I think I'm gonna skate this park right here, uh, Normandy Park. Maybe get a couple clips here just for fun.
If you enjoyed that video, please leave it a like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with a friend you also think might like it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Stay alive. Later.